Hello everybody, this is VNA and I'm doing the intro for Move Monday today. Cause it's already Monday and it's Move Monday. And you guys should be watching right now. Good job. Yay. So this is Piazza. This is um Domination with the P ninety. The P ninety. And it's pretty awesome. All right. Oh, look, there I was. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good job, babe. Thank you. All right. You guys heard it right. It's Mo Monday, and this is episode 11. And this week we have a gameplay on the map, Piazza, on Domination, which is becoming quickly my, fat, my favorite new way to get a Mo because I... I prefer to know where my enemy is spawning, not having them spawn in my butthole. So, domination is really, uh, really good for that because as long as you have one uh, flag captured by the enemy, you will know where they're spawning, at least to some degree, until um, your teammates push the spawn too hard and spawn flip them, which could become a problem. But if you're playing with a team, it's uh, pretty easy to spawn trap in this game, and you know be effective at knowing where your enemies are and where to place yourself. And for Piazza it's a little bit different because of the multiple layers and different paths and intricate um, stairways that you have to go through to get to different areas and it makes it a little bit difficult to know exactly where the spawns are going to be because I'm not even sure where every spawn on the map is yet but I'm getting better at it already and Right here you see my screen freak out and now all of a sudden the um, numbers should just get all huge and stay there. And I'm not sure what that's all about. I guess the patch they did to theater wasn't successful because this doesn't look like it's patched to me. But, you know, what are you going to do? I don't make the game so I have to deal with what they give me and hopefully they will repatch the theater mode because I do in fact use theater a lot. and until I get a better TV so I can record on 720p on my television and not have to use a different 720p TV um, I have to use theater so hopefully we'll get another theater patch because as you can see there's still that twitching bug and now this giant number bug and there's there's some things I could do with some fixing but um the class I'm running on here is the fear crads class which I stole directly from his custom classes on Call of Duty Elite and it is a P90 with rapid fire and a silencer and I believe dual scorps or FMGs I don't know I don't I don't really use the secondaries at all and um, think flash or maybe he uses concussion and then semtex I'm not quite sure on all those nitty-gritty details but for sure um, P90 rapid fire and silencer with assault package predator overwatch and pavlo and i believe the perks are sleight of hand quick draw and sit rep which i don't really use sit rep too much but um, i copied this directly from his thing so um, i got what i got and you know i haven't made any altercations to it because if it works for him I'll have it work for me and right here you can see another glitch the domination bar for when you're capturing doesn't really fill up at all but um, I digress on that they'll fix it eventually and for this map right here is critical I think is it um, if you saw my first mob on this map on my first gameplay uh, I wanted to get another mob on here so I didn't have that same gameplay on my channel like three times so that's why I got this mob last night and you know I wasn't really going for it I was going for a high scoring gameplay which is why I was running the assault kill streak um, strike package and yeah in the end I did get a high scoring gameplay but I also got the mob so it turned out well of course like I always say specialist is your best bet for a mob so getting an assault kill streak mob um, it's kind of just something that I, I don't know, I don't want to 
sound braggy, but I am able to do. But as far as like the general public, if you're trying to get an easy mob, you you don't want to run assault. And um, I don't I don't know. Maybe assault is helpful for some of you guys if you don't need all those extra perks. But trust me, if you have ever experienced specialist bonus, you know that it is by far the best way to play the game. Having all the perks and proficiencies is amazing and you really are just a super soldier and I love it but in this gameplay um, I tried to like stop using specialist for once because I've been running specialist for so long it's gotten to the point where it's fun but I, I need to like try something new and that's why I changed it up this gameplay and somehow even without the specialist I still got this mob and Right here I'm sticking around a lot, like I said earlier, this is like a critical part because you run down here and most people will long run along this path and just run down the stairs. This guy, he actually used the same point but maybe he was chasing me and he didn't see me turn left, I'm not sure, but a lot of people don't really know this map this far into the map's life I guess because it's, you know, pretty much brand new. Right there, 25 point streak Moab, woo! Anyways, this map is pretty new, so if you can get um, a hold of it rather quickly and adapt, then uh, you'll be pretty deadly, um, you know, before everybody else gets the map. Because right now, Elite Premium members are most likely people that, you know, are avid Call of Duty players and actually, you know, spent that extra 50 or 40 bucks on the Hardened Edition or just buying Elite itself. So... Odds are they might be a little bit better than your average player in this elite playlist, which is what I'm playing. But uh, uh, more often than not, you know, there's still going to be noobs, you know, trying to learn the new map and not knowing exactly where to do or where to go, not where to do. And you got to take advantage of that the best you can. And after this, you know, I die right here and I speed up the rest of the gameplay. I tried to use the theater mode to fast forward throughout um, this game to shorten it up since it was like an 11 minute gameplay and I do want to mention right here look at this boom dead from a Strella how does that happen the world may never know but uh, yeah that's pretty much it for this gameplay this P90 class is actually pretty good you can change it up to your liking with specialist bonus but P90 rapid fire with silencer is actually a pretty good class and I do recommend that as far as um, Piazza goes, SMGs for days, or shotguns if you're really good with shotguns, but I mean as far as getting an easy mob, get those SMGs out, and 63 and 4 was the final score, assault mob on Piazza, this was Mob Monday episode 11, thanks for watching guys, and see you later.